What's good with y'all? What's going on? Do not forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. Look. Yo, you had two teams from the SWAT conference ranked in the top 25 in the FCS. Let me tell you something. The spring, spring football was a big success for the SWAT conference. For HBCU football in general. Now, are they going to keep this momentum going in the fall? I believe so. I mean, you got the SWAC. You got the Mid-Eastern Atlantic Conference signing deals with ESPN that's, that's going to run through 2025. So, so hopefully you'll get more than, you get more games on ESPN. I know you're going to get the challenges. They're going to be on ESPN. So hopefully you'll get more games from the SWAT Conference and HBCU football on on ESPN Networks. Also, you have additions. You got Bethune Cookman. They're in the SWAC. You got Florida A&M. People are already talking about the Florida A&M J, um, Jackson State game in September, and it's just May. So the spring did wonders for the SWAT Conference, and there's so much momentum and money coming to the SWAT conference that they got to keep this momentum going. Keep this going and, and then you have all the transfers coming to the SWAT conference. Then you got Jackson State. They're going to be able to play all their all their transfers that came to the school in 2020. Early 2021. So it's going to be exciting football. And, and all us, that's right, all corn, they're coming back too. They took the spring off, and you know, they're always good. They're always running things in the swag. So it's going to be a good football. It's going to be a good football season come fall. And I just can't wait for it to happen. I'm going to talk to these guys later. It's Corner Sports Net.